hello students good day and welcome back to this channel in today's video we are going to learn how to solve linear equations and also we are going to learn how to find the truth set for a given linear equation in one variable in this video we are going to solve a number of examples let's start off with the first example solve the equation 2x minus 1 over 3 minus x minus 2 over 4 equals 1 So let's solve this together. Now let's rewrite the question. 2x minus 1 over 3 minus x minus 2 over 4 equals 1. Now to solve this problem, the first thing we are going to do is to do away with the fraction. Now we have two fractions. We have 2x minus 1 over 3 and then we have x minus 2 over 4. So these are the two fractions. We need to do away with the fraction so that we can solve for x. Now to do away with the fraction, we need to find the LCM between the denominators. So we have 3 and then 4. Now the LCM between 3 and 4 is 12. So we are going to multiply each term of this equation by the LCM which is 12. So we have 12 times 2x minus 1 over 3. This is one term. And then we multiply this also by 12. So 12 times x minus 2 over 4 equals, we also multiply 1 by 12. And then this is what we have. Now let's simplify this expression. Now 3 goes into itself once, 3 goes into 12 four times so we have four times 2x minus 1 minus 4 goes into itself once into 12 three times we have 3 times x minus 2 equals now 12 times 1 is 12 now let's simplify furthermore so 4 times 2x is 8x 4 times negative 1 is negative 4. We have negative 3 times x, that is negative 3x. And then negative 3 times negative 2 is positive 6. This is equal to 12. Now let's simplify like things. So 8x minus 3x is 5x. Negative 4 plus 6 is 2 equals 12. So we transpose 2 to the right hand side, we have 5x equals 12 minus 2, 5x equals 10, and then we divide through by 5, and then we have x to be equal to 2. So the value of x for this particular equation is 2. Now let's move on to the next question. Now let's solve the second question. Find the truth set of the equation 3 over 4 times x plus 1 plus 1 equals 1 over 2 times x minus 2 plus 5. We are going to find the truth set for this equation. So we have 3 over 4 times x plus 1 plus 1 equals 1 over 2 times x minus 2 plus 5. Now the first thing that we need to do, as I said earlier on, is to do away with the fractions if we have any in the question. Here we have two fractions, this is one fraction, and then this is another fraction. Now the LCM between 4 and 2 is 4. So we are going to multiply each term of the linear equation by 4. So we have 4 times 3 over 4 times x plus 1 plus 4 times 1 equals 4 times 1 over 2 times x minus 2 plus 
4 times 5. Now let's simplify. 4 cancels out 4. We are left with 3 times x plus 1 plus 4 times 1 is 4 equals 2 goes into itself once into 4 2 times. So we have 2 times x minus 2 plus 4 times 5 is 20. Now let's multiply 3 and then 2 across. So we have 3x plus 3 plus 4 equals 2 times x is 2x. 2 times negative 2 is negative 4 plus 20. Now this becomes 3x plus 3 plus 4 is 7 equals 2x negative 4 plus 20 is plus 16. We transpose 2x to the left hand side, 7 to the right hand side. So that becomes 3x minus 2x equals 16 minus 7. This becomes x and then we have x equals 9. So this is the value of x. Now because we are asked to find the truth set of the equation, then we say that the truth set of the equation is x is such that x is equal to 9. So this is how to find the true set of a linear equation. Let's solve some more examples. So for the third question, find the truth set of the equation 1 over 3 times x plus 3 minus 2 times x minus 5 equals 4 whole number 1 over 3. So let's solve this problem. We have 1 over 3 times x plus 3 minus 2 times x minus 5 equals 4 whole number 1 over 3. Now we have a fraction or we have fractions so we need to do away with the fractions. So before we do away with the fraction let's convert this mixed number to an improper fraction. So we have 1 over 3 times x plus 3 minus 2 times x minus 5 equals now we multiply 3 by 4 to give us 12 and then plus 1 we have 13 so this becomes 13 over 3 now the denominators are common we have 3 and then 3 so the LCM will be 3 so we are going to multiply each term of the linear equation by 3 so this becomes 3 times 1 over 3 times x plus 3 minus 3 times 2 times x minus 5 equals 3 times 13 over 3. Now let's simplify. 3 cancels out 3. We are left with 1 times x plus 3. So we have x plus 3 minus 3 times 2 is 6. So we have 6 times x minus 5 equals 3 cancels out 3. We are left with 13. So this becomes x plus 3 minus 6 times x is 6x and then negative 6 times negative 5 is 30. This is equal to 13. x minus 6x is negative 5x. 3 plus 30 is 33. And this is equal to 13. So we are going to transpose 33 to the right hand side. So we have negative 5x equals 13 minus 33 and this is equal to negative 20. So we have 5x, negative 5x equals negative 20. We divide through by negative 5 by negative 5 and then we have x to be equal to 
4. So x is equal to 4. So the truth set for this equation is x is such that x is equal to 4. So let's solve question number 4. Find the truth set of the equation 3x plus 7 over 10 minus 2x minus 1 over 5 equals x. So we have 3x plus 7 over 10 minus 2x minus 1 over 5 equals x. Now we have two fractions. We are going to do away with the fractions. Now the LCM between 10 and 5 is 10. So we multiply all the terms in the equation by 10. So we have 10 times 3x plus 7 over 10 minus 10 times 2x minus 1 over 5 equals 10 times x. So 10 cancels out 10. We are left with 3x plus 7 minus 5 goes into itself once into 10 two times so we have 2 times 2x minus 1 equals 10 times x is 10x now let's simplify we have 3x plus 7 minus 4x plus 2 equals 10x 3x minus 4x is negative x 7 plus 2 is 9 equals 10x. Now let's transpose negative x to the right hand side and we have 9 equals 11x. Because we are going to find the value of x, we divide through by 11 and then we have x equals 9 over 11. So the truth set for this equation is x is such that x is equal to 9 over 11.